Hey guys, welcome to Geeta's Kitchen. Today I'm going to share the recipe of how to make chettinad kara chettini for idli and dosa in under 5 minutes at your home. So for this recipe, what you need, here I took one onion, chopped onion and here I have two uh, red uh, tomatoes, chopped red tomatoes uh, and here I took uh, uh, two to three uh, red chilies. Uh, so let's start the recipe. So I'm going to prepare this recipe in the pressure cooker. So take a big pressure cooker, take a non-stick pressure cooker or you can use uh, the um, ordinary pressure cooker also. So in this I'm going to add some oil. So here I, I here I am adding one tablespoon of oil and when the oil is little bit hot we have to add all these things like onion, tomato and red chilies. And uh, if you want, you can add uh, two to three uh, 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 garlic also. But I'm not use, uh, going to use any garlic, uh, and I'm going to fry all these things together. And I'm going to add some salt as per taste. So I added the salt as per taste. What I'm going to do, I'm going to cover this one with the lid and going to cook for up to 3 whistles or you can cook for 5 minutes. Uh, so that is uh, up to your choice. Uh, I'm not going to add any water because this tomato itself have lot of water so they will cook. So I'm going to add some tamarind guys. So this is a must for the tanginess. So in all the South Indian chutneys, um, that is the red chutney, we have to add the tamarind. And I'm going to cover this one with the lid. So I cover this one with the lid. And I'm going to cook for 3 whistles or as I said you can cook for 5 minutes. Please put the timer. So I have already 2 whistles and I'm waiting for one more. And it's time to switch off the uh, flame. Nice aroma guys. Uh, and when it becomes cooled down we have to um, grind it in the blender. So I open the lid. Can you see how it's nicely cooked I didn't add any water so no need to add water because the tomato itself has lot of water so they will cook nicely what I'm going to do I'm uh, when it becomes cooled down I will grind it in the blender as a smooth paste and my chetinad kara chutney is ready but uh, uh, they don't uh, do any tempering but I love to do tempering into this. It gives a nice taste. So for the tempering, I added one uh, tablespoon of oil in the uh, kadai and I added one teaspoon of uh, mustard seeds and one to two teaspoon of urud dal. It gives a crunchiness in the chutney. So this is optional guys. For this chutney, generally in Chattinad, they don't do any tempering. But um, uh, in our family, uh, this is a must. We we'll like this one. So that's why I'm doing this one. Uh, so yeah, I added some ink powder. And I'm going to mix uh, this one in this uh, uh, chutney. can you see lot of urid dal the mustard seeds the ink powder it gives a nice uh, uh, flavor in this uh, uh, red chutney 
So this is basically a kara chutney. Kara means spicy, guys. So this is a quick video of how to make a spicy chutney uh, for idli and dosa at your home. Uh, see you soon in my another cooking video. If you like this video, please hit the like button and please subscribe to my channel. And thanks for watching. Bye.